So what we have uh, behind me here is what we would call our surge capacity tent. This is a part of our process for when we have a, a surge of patients that we need to deal with um, and we want to be prepared. So what we have today is set up what it would look like and this is our mock trial just to see what happens and, and how it's working and make sure that this process is running efficiently so that when we're ready to turn it on, we have it. So this would be where we receive patients just like we normally do in the emergency department. Obviously this would be in anticipation of a high volume of patients who are concerned that they may have symptoms consistent with coronavirus and how are we going to rapidly triage, assess them, evaluate them, and disposition them safely. So all of our patients when they would arrive to the emergency department we want to first capture them at our check-in station. And here's where we're going to identify what they're coming to the emergency department for. So patients that are coming in for potential um, coronavirus symptoms, most predominantly what we know, cough, fever, shortness of breath. Those are the patients that we're going to want to try and identify to be directed towards our tent. The second part is where we're going to have a nurse do some additional screening questions to make sure we can take our high risk populations um, and we can bring them into the emergency department to make sure that we're providing the correct care for them. And then the next step would be to bring our patients to registration where they would get checked in and then move them into the tent where we can care for them in our treatment area. So right now it's is the unknown, right? The, the, what, what number of patients are we gonna be dealing with? Obviously, we've designed this to be able to handle a large volume of patients. We just don't know when that's gonna happen and how soon that's gonna happen and how quickly we're gonna to need to process that. Most people, when we look at models, we, we know we're several weeks behind um, where, you know, places like New York or New Orleans or even Seattle and Washington. And we've had this opportunity to see what's happening there and watch and take their experiences. And now we can, we can use that to, to change our processes to make sure that we're ready to handle it. And it's given us time to develop things like this and give us opportunity to do a mock run of our tent so that we're ready to go when we need it.